The leader of the Islamic State has been killed in a counter-terror operation carried out by the United States in northwestern Syria. Abu Ibrahim al-Hashimi al-Qureshi, the leader of ISIS there, set off a blast, killing himself and his family as special forces rounded on his hideout after a gunfight. U.S. President Joe Biden is hailing it as a major victory. Last night's operation took a major terrorist leader off the battlefield and it sent a strong message to terrorists around the world. We will come after you and find you. Once again, today, we continue our unceasing effort to keep the American people safe and to strengthen the security of our allies and partners around the world. I want to thank you all and may God bless you and may God protect our troops. The American raid targeted a three-story residential building on the outskirts of the town of Atmeh near Idlib province. The region is a stronghold of terror groups, many of which are fighting against the Bashar al-Assad-led Syrian government. Syrian rescue workers say at least 13 other people were killed in the mission. We note with concern reports of civilian casualties. Daesh has committed heinous crimes and brought tragedy and death to thousands of men, women, and children. And we want to take this moment to, rem to remember the victims and families of terrorism uh, and families of victims of terrorism everywhere in the world. President Joe Biden said the mission was carried out in a manner which tried to minimize civilian casualties and said the team is now compiling a report on the operation. The Pentagon did accept that three people were killed in the blast. So we know that, uh, uh, that when Abdullah uh, detonated an explosive device, which obviously killed him, uh, uh, we know that there were uh, three people on that third floor with him. Uh, that were also killed, uh, his wife uh, and two children. Um, uh, and uh, so that's what I'm talking about when I talk about the, the, the three. Uh, we also know, as I said, that uh, we were able to safely evacuate 10 individuals, six from the first floor, an adult male, an adult female, uh, and, uh, and uh, four children, and then four children from the second floor, uh, which our forces were able to safely get uh, to get uh, out of the building.